President Donald Trump is a narcissist, and potentially one of the most dangerous people on the planet, because of the position he holds as president of the world's most powerful nation, Trump's big floor ducks scrutiny, October 11th. He now has an excuse for his bizarre behavior, but what excuse do all his supporting Republicans have, not to mention the Murdoch press? History will not judge any of them kindly. Mary Lawson, Merrick of the Illustration, Matt Golding credit, tipping the balance given the opportunity, I would happily sign Kevin Rudd's petition, Rudd petition for news. Corp inquiry gains early traction, October 11th. The News Corp Daily Sydney tabloid, in particular its opinion columnists, is heavily biased to the political and ideological right but will occasionally give lefty or progressive views and climate action advocates some column inches. News Corp's national broadsheet, however, is relentless in its glaringly obvious political and ideological bias and is a haven for reactionaries who love coal, have begun an affair with gas, dismiss global warming and applaud corporate greed. It is also relentless in its persecution of the hapless Victorian Premier. It remains ignorant of the meaning of balance. Bring on the inquiry. Douglas Mackenzie, Deakin, Act Advertisement Absolutely ropeable fits on Sunday says a thousand times no to roping off Bondi Beach, I agree a thousand times with him, a thousand times no to roping off Bondi Beach, October 11th. Kath Fraser, Bellevue Hill long way to go The proposal to allow a patron density of one person per two square meters just doesn't cut the mustard, reprieve on table for cafes and pubs, October 11th. A physical separation of 1.5 meters makes eminent sense, simple mathematics will show that a circle of 1.5 meters radius has an area of just over 7 square meters, this should be the benchmark, our politicians have been listening to the science for these last six months. Now is not the time to forget the mathematics. Gwyn Boyd, Mossman on Pumas it would double the ability for cafes and restaurants, which would have a big impact on the economy, Dominic Perot had said. Yes, treasurer, and that is just the concentration of people which have a big impact on health. Please try to remember that your paid employment as a member of the NSW government is to protect the people, not just your donors. Ian Usman Lewis, Kentucky Cancer on Society The NSW government is explicitly going to cause lung cancers as part of its public policy for Crown, thus continuing its immoral support for gambling despite its own health department's long-standing policy to control smoking in public and corporate areas. Smoke alarm no match for exempt casinos, October 11th. Many people have described gambling as a cancer on society, now we have the chance to watch a metaphor become real. Barry Lyon, Castle Cove telling tales your article caused quite a bit of consternation here in our paradise when first read until it became clear the topic concerned was the Rattus Rattus variety and not Homo sapiens variety, Rat Race, Vermin follow suit to suburbs, October 11th. Stuart Smith, Tea Gardens Buon Appetito My Italian language learning classes have been on hold since COVID-19 restrictions came into force. Pizzi cooking class offers a taste of Italian, October 15. How I miss the camaraderie of my fellow students and our ever-patient Italian teacher. Every year, as a fundraiser, she creates a two-course Italian meal, with the help of her husband and her family. Her students help serve the tavola. I have yet to perfect the sugo like my northern Italian mother used to make, suggest to my tutor to teach students both the language and cooking skills, when classes resume. Gloria Velli, Belrose School of Life Helen Pitt's advice for later life addressed to HSS concludes, it's time to flesh out the story of your life and every new chapter begins with a blank page, the ABC of the HSC for the class of 2020, October 11th, to suggest an addition to the C's? Careful, be careful how you use social media, as the pen that writes your life story is in your own hand. Alan Gibson, 
Cherry Brook wonderful semantics for the HSC students with Pitts ABC. I hope the students make time to read it. Anson Stewart, why Tara the ABC of the HSC for the class of 2020 could be the forerunner of a bestseller, the art, guidelines for all Australians all the time, Joy Cooksey, Harrington most viewed in national Let's Block ads, why? Show your love for him. Click the link in description. Thanks for watching.